Very important. The other ones should be marked. There should be eight of them, and it should be marked. Well, it's not on this page, but um, also on the original, we want a rent section and the financial section, but we want those under separate cover, under separate packages, in separate envelopes. So you have a three ring binder, you have two envelopes in there, one that's gonna be marked rent and one that's gonna be marked the financial section. And we only want that in the original section. And the reason why is we have different groups that actually um, score those two sections. So there's no reason, because again, this is where we go through pulling everything out. Um, all the other eight copies should include all the other sections. Now, on the front of the proposal, the first one, the original one, should be marked original, and the other eight should be one of eight, two of eight, three of eight. It helps us to really control where the proposals are and who has them. As well as we want the package number that you are proposing to be on the front cover of the page. Um, there's also a set of tabs, and every set of tabs, it's an exhibit H, very important, with the proposal checklist should tell you what we are expecting behind each tab. And then we would like an electronic copy of the proposal on a disk or a thumb drive in an Adobe or Word type format. And, th and then um, basically our electronic proposals will not be submitted. Uh, we, don't want, we really don't want videos, sample products, or any other type of collateral, anything that might, you know, that is not in within this three ring binder. Your proposal really should be within the three ring binder. And uh, we want them in a cardboard box, whether it's one cardboard box, two cardboard boxes, but we really don't want fancy cases or any other kind of um, carrying device with your proposal. It makes it easy for us. We can process them quickly and then we can go through the, our whole evaluation process a lot quicker. So are there any questions? That is, uh, we actually do want the rent and the financial in the PDF because that will stay with the, with a certain team. Is there any other questions? Yes. Remember that nice little video that we did in the beginning? Okay. Um, if you have any nice pictures of your merchandise, please include them in that, um, either the CD or the thumb drive to make sure that, you know, we want to show off. We want to show who those winners are. And if you happen to have any video, give us that too. Thank you. All right, great. Well, up next to help close our presentation down today is Mr. Buchanan, our Executive Vice President of Revenue Management. You're up. Oh, good afternoon. Man, I was, over, I was back there listening so intent uh, at this team. Um, now, what a turnout. What a really, really good turnout. We appreciate uh, you coming here. When I uh, spoke to you um, at the last Terminal A RFP, um, those, of you, those of you who might remember, I used a baseball analogy. And I talked to you about uh, how we, DFW, really wanted to uh, hit this RFP out the ballpark. We really wanted to hit a home run. Uh, I talked to you about the fact that we were considered, at least at that time, the number four airport in the world for 40 million passengers and above uh, in the areas of customer service and exceeding the customer expectations, only to be behind your Dubais and your Beijings and your Hong Kongs of the world, and that this $2 billion investment that the airport is putting into renovating our terminals uh, will 
update our facilities to be able to compete on a world scale and if we were to put world class concessions within those facilities i felt that we would hit a home run that we would really knock it out the ballpark well i think we did uh, looking at uh, some of the uh, uh, awards and the proposals that came in uh, in the RFP uh, for Terminal A, I think we really, really hit it uh, out the ballpark. But now we're going to have a really uh, great opportunity to really round out uh, the terminal. And hopefully by providing you the information, the adjacencies, what's around you, those types of things that will allow you the opportunity to bring your best presentation to uh, enhance the, uh, the airport. Uh, we'll have brands, uh, we've had brands that are local, regional, national, international. Um, and you know, we've had a few brands that have never been featured in an airport uh, before and we're really excited about that. Uh, we have uh, operators who have a lot of experience, and we have some operators who are new to the airport environment, and we're extremely excited about that. Uh, most of you all know that tonight is the uh, baseball all-star game, and uh, you know every team has an opportunity to, to have one representative at the all-star game. And if you're a really good team, you got an opportunity to have maybe four or five players uh, at the All-Star game. Uh, I'm really, really excited for the fact that I think Terminal A, everybody that is participating in the Terminal A, as you can see, are all on the All-Star team. I think Terminal A really, truly represent the best of the best uh, within our industry, and I'm really looking forward to rounding that off. There's a couple of things that I need you to do for those who will be participating in the supplemental RFP. Uh, really do your homework. Uh, all the information that Michael and Martha and, and, and everybody shared really is to help you uh, put your best proposal uh, forward. Uh, hopefully we're getting better at, the pro at this process uh, we've got four more terminals to go. Uh, this is the supplemental to Terminal A. We still have four more terminals uh, to go. And uh, before it's all said and done, we'll be redoing all of our new international Terminal D uh, all over again. So this is a really exciting uh, time at DFW. But do your homework. Hopefully we're providing you with the feedback uh, that you need to get even better with your proposals and I hear everybody tell me, what do you want? What do you want? What do you want, DFW? What do you want? What do you want? Well, these guys are telling you uh, what we want, and I hope it's clear to you. I would continue to ask you to ask questions so that it is extremely clear to you uh, so that you can put the best proposal uh, together. Hopefully, the process gets easier for you. Uh, I know there's a lot of components to it, but once you go through it once, and you get that debriefing and a lot of clarification, hopefully the next time it gets a little bit easier and a little bit easier uh, for you. Uh, make sure you follow all the tips that staff talked about uh, today. It's really for your, your benefit. Um, and make sure that you submit your proposal on time. I heard Ron talk about, uh, you know, you can submit it a day early, but if you're one minute late, uh, it's not gonna be accepted. Uh, so really, please take heed uh, to that. And lastly, I just want to wish you guys all the best. Uh, I really want to see you part of this Terminal A all-star team. Man, these are some great concepts uh, that we have. And I am so proud of many of you that have stepped up and are represented uh, here uh, uh, for Terminal A. But I wish you all the best. Uh, thank you for coming out today. And I thank you for showing interest in DFW Airport. So thank you very much. And is the meeting adjourned? All right, that's it. <laughs>